All right, Kate Bilo's here with a check on our forecast. So, yep, it's getting yeah. warmer. Thought it, it was going to be going the other way. But. Yeah, <laughs> it's, we're going back to summer, apparently. We're two weeks from fall. Two weeks from today, fall okay. will be here. But it's it's going to feel like summer again. Yeah. We're back to near 90 by wow. Wednesday and Thursday of this week. I'll and drag out the shorts again. Well. Yeah, yep. <laughs> yeah don't no put them away. No more sweaters. We had some sweater weather over the weekend, at least in the mornings last Friday. But now, pack them away again. You're going to want the shorts and T-shirts at least for the next few days, unfortunately. It's a little cloudy outside today, but it's been relatively quiet. There are a few more showers that are firing up now. Most of them are east of the city. You can see Ocean City is still dry. There are still a few people on the beach, but the clouds are starting to billow in, and there are showers not too far away from there. So if you're down there, you know anyone that may be out on the beach, you may want to shoot them a text and say, you know what, some rain's coming. Pack the stuff up, pack it all up in one of those handy beach carts, and head on back to the house because things are getting a little dicey down across South Jersey, especially now areas from the city on west where it is still dry. We're in the 80s right now, 80 degrees uh, in Allentown, 82 in Philadelphia, 81 in Reading and 80 here in Wilmington. Millville's at 75, Wildwood's at 78, and you can see an east wind has kept the showers at bay for most of the day, but a few of them are firing up here now across portions of Cumberland and Atlantic counties and a few more across portions of Mercer and Burlington County. So you can see just nothing severe, no even thunder storm activity haven't had any reports of lightning out there but just a couple of more intense downpours up across northern Burlington County one over Maple Shade right now and further to the south we've got this line of showers from Newfield down toward Buena Vista into Weymouth and Mays Landing here along 40 that could slow things down for the evening rush there and right over Bridgeton as well headed toward Millville there is another shower now the east wind may hold them back from the immediate coast but can't rule out a stray sprinkle through the next hour or so and then later tonight we'll see those sprinkles die out overnight clouds and a few breaks Tomorrow will be a mostly cloudy day from the city on northwest. More sunshine once again down the shore and in Delaware. A pretty, a pretty quiet day, not a whole lot going on. Maybe again a stray sprinkle, but not a ton of sunshine. It'll be a lot like today where we're kind of in and out of the clouds and sun throughout the course of the afternoon. Wednesday, more sunshine through the day, and that's when it really starts to heat up. You can see a line of thunderstorms approaching the northern suburbs by 5 p.m., and those may push in later Wednesday evening or Wednesday night. But summer is not over yet. Two weeks left in summer, and it's going to start to feel like it. High pressure in control, hot and humid weather returns thanks to a south west wind bringing all the heat and humidity in from the Gulf of Mexico and the deep south and we could get near 90 in some spots on Wednesday. Overnight mainly cloudy with a stray shower at 64 degrees. Tomorrow is warm. More clouds than sun will be at 81 for the daytime high and your eyewitness weather seven day forecast. It's a two day warm up Wednesday and Thursday near 90 degrees. Thursday brings a better chance for thunderstorms. We could see one Wednesday night. Thursday showers and storms along the front and then Friday's much cooler. The high only 70 Five. That doesn't last though. You might think, oh, fall's coming. Nope. We're back to the 80s over the weekend, and we'll stay there into next week. Ooh, okay. okay. At least not snowing. It's not yeah, snowing. Nope. No complaints. <laughs> we got that going for us. Thank you.